As much as I like sports and stuff, like I've always kind of been like a girly girls to an extent too. So I've always kind of wanted to do something that was like, you know, like glitz and glam and all. Inspired by her mom, Benton County senior Zan Hale decided to trade in her jersey to give her prom dress one last moment to sparkle in the spotlight. I was like, where would I even wear it again? She was like, well, be at a pageant or something. And I was like, well, what do you mean? Am I allowed, am I allowed to do something like, like that? I think she's beautiful and I thought that, you know, she would just benefit from the experience and I thought she would do well. She's got that big smile. But winning a pageant is about more than just a smile. It takes a lot of hard work and dedication. I would walk through the living room and like walk down my hallway and act like I was walking out on stage. Because I, just, like, I was really worried about tripping like on the stage so I had to prepare for that. But when the day finally arrived, there was no time to worry about falling. The whole day was really rainy, so that was kind of a problem. We had our interview, get dressed up and get ready for that. My friend's mom had done my hair. There were so many people there. Oh, it was nerve wracking. Although she's been through a lot of adrenaline pumping moments on the court, those nerves were nothing compared to what she was about to experience on her way to winning Miss Vinton County. I'm probably most nervous for the question that I didn't know what it was going to be because like, a lot of the people before me, I was trying to like answer their questions like while they were getting questions and I was like, I couldn't answer that. I couldn't answer that. While Hale was performing on stage, her family and friends were supporting her just a few feet away in the audience. I had like my own little cheering section. Like and when I would, I could, like heard them like yelling for me, but it was really nerve-wracking up there. And you like don't see anybody when you're up on the stage. After a lifetime of athletics, it was finally time for Zan to experience the glitz and glamour she always dreamt of. I've watched her play sports, you know, from the time she was about four years old, and to see her on the softball field, volleyball court, basketball court, and then to see her in a dress, competing, you know, in that kind of setting was definitely a different experience as a parent. You know, every girl like, you know, like wants to wear like a crown, so it's really cool when you put on your crown and you're like, you know, you feel like you're a queen for a day. You have to be like a role model, you know what I mean? Like once this is on, you have to be careful and be a role model because it's like, it's like a special, like an honor.